Hey, what's going on, ET? This is Shoban here from Martian Technology, and today we will be taking a quick look at Sandwich Mod 13 for the Nexus uh, 5. So, this is running on the Android latest version of Android, which is Android 6.0.1. And let's take a look at its features and all the new things. So, we have a new wallpaper in Sandwich Mod 13, which looks pretty nice. I really like it. And the overall performance is really smooth. Sandwich Mod has its own new camera application as well, which has a lot of features and which I would definitely recommend you to use over Google camera because it has more customizability and it is fast you have modes as well like recording panorama and camera photo so let's take a look at the settings and let's take a look at all the features so you have toggles for Wi-Fi Bluetooth and mobile network on the front or on the top and then let's take a look at other features on this so uh, OS or Sandwich Mod 30. So we have display and lights, themes, uh, notifications, lock screen, and all of that. We are going to go deep on everything. So on display and lights, you have adaptive uh, display, which is for every OS. But the new thing is you have LCD density in a year. So we have so many LCD density, so you can select any one of them uh, which you like. So we have themes, which is one of the major uh, features of the Sanjay Mod OS, which is Theme Engine, which you can install many themes and customize your smartphone. Then you have uh, this lock screen where you can just add lock on your device. You have security where you can have, uh, oh, you have this buttons where you can just customize your buttons. Like you can turn on your device with the volume rocker, as you can see over there, and it works with it, which is pretty smooth and i like it then you got a security where you'll find this on all android devices nothing new here and on you have, will find status bar over there where you can customize your clock or any other thing which you can uh, add your clock in the center then you can customize your battery thing and all of this good stuff and then last you don't have anything you have that about phone and you have sanity mode updates as well you can where you can update your sanity mode 30 you know, rom and yeah it's it which is pretty good so it's just pretty much it for this video if you find this video helpful then make sure to drop a like and make sure to subscribe my channel for more video contents like this and i would be linking a download link of sanity mode 13 including all the g apps in the description from which you can install it for your nexus 5. for more rom videos on the nexus 5 like this make sure to subscribe and comment down below thanks so much for watching and i'll catch you guys in my next video